According to the Business Insider, in 2050, the Philippines will have a $3.334 trillion economy from which the country will earn a spot as ranked 19 from the world's most powerful economies. Is this prediction for real or just a mere fiction? Previously the country earned the spot for being the most worthy country for investment. The finance secretary Carlos Dominguez attributed it to strong macroeconomic fundamentals and the De 30 government's plans for an expensive infrastructure program. On the other hand, Senator Lauren Legada confidently declared that the Philippine economy would now become more robust. Exerting efforts for nation building had made the country more progressive than ever before. A 19th rank from global economies is very possible, even surpassing it. If the Filipinos managed to secure this competitiveness and managed to fix the shortcomings on entrepreneurship, taxation and opportunities, the country will lead its people on where it's supposed to be. A country with plenty of potential, underrated by the foolishness of its people. The corruption which had turned into a cultural norm. The discipline that is fading away. From all Filipinos all over the world, do the country have a chance? Do this country can show to the world that it has a potential and it can surpass that potential? The problem is in the people and not the environment. It is the people who can answer and make a change.